James wines, we have Chateau La Motte Dio. This is a Bordeaux wine. Stay tuned, I'll tell you more about it. So uh, what we have here is an affordable Bordeaux wine. And I say that because I think a lot of people that I talk to about Bordeaux is, um, you know, the, the common, you know, elevation of thought is all French wines are super expensive and that is not true. What we have now, this is called Chateau Le Mont Dio. This is from the Cadillac Côte de Bordeaux. Now, this is a 13.5% ABV wine. It's a really dominant wine in terms of this being Merlot-oriented. Uh, this wine is 60% Merlot, 30% Cabernet Sauvignon, and 10% Cabernet Franc. A really nice combination of these varieties playing well together. That's what you're gonna find in this region. So Merlot, for me, really represents some beauty and characteristic that uh, you can definitely get more Cabernet Sauvignon characteristic wines versus Merlot characteristic wines. You get one or the other of Cabernet Sauvignon or Merlot dominant. Uh, to me, it depends what mood I'm in and are they identifiable, I would say so. And I think they're really elegant and beautiful and wonderful and uh, $15 price point, by the way. So the point score is 91 points out of 100 points. And so I open this up with my Chot Zviso glass. This is a nice, beautiful bowl. And what I like about this wine glass is it really characterizes this wine nicely and uh, without much effort. A bit of a swirl and it's really bringing out the exquisite notes of this particular wine. And uh, you know, I actually put this aside one day. Uh, I was writing my notes and I came back to it and just, you know, not even putting my notes to the, the glass itself. I was a bit distant away from it. And the scent characterization, because the glass was so good, came right through and uh, expressed itself very, very nicely. And this uh, blackberry, red cherry, moist forest floor, as well as uh, red roses. And next, the palette characterization. A wash and acid, which I really enjoy. Gonna go well with many, many foods. Cudry, gonna go well with cheeses, beef, lamb, so many dishes, and uh, pizza. Something simple as well is gonna go nicely with this wine. So in this uh, characterization, so on the palate, I'm getting a blueberry note, blackberry confit notes, so it's really concentrated fruit notes, but not over the top. So on this uh, blue and blackberry notes, um, I would even trim this as a blue and blackberry confit, as well as white pepper notes, a bit of thyme and, and tarragon notes. So I'm getting beautiful savory notes on the finish, and that's what I really want for my Bordeaux wines. And um, if I didn't have that, that's the handshake that I really want between the fruit and uh, some of the other characteristics that come along and balance the wine out. More videos to come, more information will be listed down below. So thank you for your support, I really appreciate it. And uh, you can do me some favors here. Now, if you could help me out, I'd really appreciate it. Subscribe button's right up here, so please hit that button. And down below, questions and comments, the like button's down below, so please hit that button. Share this video with your family and friends. Thank you for watching. I do appreciate your support. Many more wines to come. 2018 is a fabulous year for tasting great wines. Thank you for your support. Stay tuned for more. Something.